Hello everyone, welcome. We are going to work on a abstract flow watercolor. It's a really lovely way of working with watercolor. It's a one session watercolor, so you start and you finish. You don't need to let things dry in between. It's quite colorful, it's lovely and direct. And we are going to do something like that. So for your abstract flow landscape, you need to pre-wet your paper. I usually put my paper with these exercises on a board and I put it on a slight angle. I just put a bit of masking tape underneath the top. So once you've pre-wet your paper, you can actually start using the colors that you've pre-mixed. And I usually start with my lightest ones and I usually start at the top. Just remember to use a good size brush. You don't want to use a brush that's too small. And then gradually when you've started using the lighter colors, you move on to your more intense colors that you have pre-mixed. We just want to use our pre-mixed colors first because they are a little bit lighter and a little bit less intense. So at this stage I'm actually using quite a strong um, indigo, almost a pure indigo. Um, don't be afraid to drop in colors that are actually pure straight out of your palette, but make sure they're still a little bit wet. If it is too dry, they won't flow as nicely. As your painting is drying slightly or slowly, you can still make changes. So you can see I am adding some more color up the top. I'm adding slightly stronger colors down the bottom and I keep working until I am happy with the composition and the strength of colors in my painting. So I'm at the stage now where I can just let my watercolor dry. It just needs time for the watercolor pigments to do its magic with water. <laughs> 